whosoever holds the flashlight. If he be worthy, he shall possess the power. Ace beam. What's this? Piece of cake. Howdy guys. So today we're gonna look at the Ace Beam X65 Mini and it is a big sucker. It, it's not a miniature flashlight at all. Um, based off of the X65, I'm assuming one of their big budgets, uh, you know, Lumen War uh, previous flashlight, and this is a miniature version of it, and it's still big. Now let's check the size. Um, big, what, more than 17 centimeters-ish. Let's check out the head size. Uh, that's what she said. Uh, 11 centimeters, so quite a big flashlight. Now let's check out that weight. For 18650 cells, it comes with cells. In true ace beam fashion, let's see, one pound, 13 ounce, 17, one pound, 13 ounce, about, and uh, 843 grams. So not a lightweight, but um, it's going to give you a lot of power. So let's check out the LEDs. Five, yeah, five Cree HXP 35, which are, you, you usually find those inside throwers, but... Um, here they are in a little smaller reflector, so you're not going to get that kind of pencil beam, but uh, you, you'll get probably a little bit more wider beam, but it's definitely a thrower um, over 1.4 kilometers. Yeah, that's right. Uh, so pretty cool. The UI, very, very simple. One digital switch, click on, click off, and when it's on, you hold it to ramp through the different uh, outputs so here we have uh, low so you have four four in the main area and then hold it will go into mid one hold again mid two hold once more high oh my god all right it's quite high and then you have the double click yikes yikes oh but wait there's more one more thing from off hold yep and it's on you can see the, the green light that's uh you'll get the ultra low which is actually to be honest it is useful so you probably notice this light turning on every time you turn the flashlight on okay so um this green light which shows on constant will be green if the cells the voltage is over 12.6 volts and then it'll be a constant red when it drops below 12.6, then a red flash when it's below 11.6. So what else that comes with it? You get your tripod thing, your little D-ring, lanyard, so you can hold it and uh, in case you plan on dropping it. I don't know why. If you do plan on dropping it, it's going to survive about one meter. That's what they claim, but you don't want to drop these things, I'm sure. Let's take a look what's inside. So actually, let me just mention, mechanical shutoff, right? You got the mechanical lockout by unscrewing it. So what's inside? It's actually the carrier, ooh la la. The carrier, it has a positive and negative. So it's actually that pretty cool carrier where you can actually insert it either way. It's safe that way. And then to kind of have like the plastic protection and one side is probably the positive, then this is the negative point. So that makes that con contact of the positive and negative on the inside. Uh, if you have a searchlight, everybody knows, not everybody knows, that you can just turn it on, ceiling bounce it, right? Ceiling bounce it inside your house in your room, and then your whole room is lit, and you don't have to use candles. Who needs flashlights? Candles are romantic. <laughs> 
it also has emergency use. You don't have to use it as a search light as well. So you have the search light function if you need it and you have uh, emergency in your house uh, room lighting kind of light. Uh, so that's pretty cool, right? Lots of uses, whatever you can come up with, right? Whatever you can you lie to your <laughs> wife about, you know. Beam shots coming up. Um, since this is sort of a special light, 1.4 kilometers. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to have to bring out the big guns for this one. Yeah, if you're a guy, you know, treat yourself, you get one of these and just play around with it. It might be a novelty to you, but, you know, just get it and enjoy it and play around with it. And you might find yourself actually going out for a walk just to use it. So you can be very healthy for you. Um, just like you have the dog owners and they have to walk the dogs out at night because the dogs need to get out. And they want to know maybe you want to know who let the dogs out and it's probably yourself and then so you're out there walking your dog or you can use something like this or you don't have a dog and this just gives you some reason to go out and just because you want to play around with the flashlight um so yeah whatever reasons uh so it's a cool flashlight you know even though it's heavy um you know you need that kind of heft to be honest to make this a practical light for that kind of lumens if you wanted to withhold that type of lumens and uh, the battery is for 18650s so um, all the IMR these are good uh, ace beam IMR cells that, that comes with it so when you look at this light let's see I think the light can run maybe around 260 what is the street price on this now maybe around 260 maybe we can find a deal around you know 260 uh, US dollars, so um, that includes the cells, right? That's maybe like 30 bucks worth of free cells inside of it. So um, you, it's actually the value of the flashlight is pretty good. So yeah, I hope you enjoy watching this review. And uh, of course, all that good stuff that you know about, which is liking, sharing, subscribing, and and I don't know what else you can do dislike it all right uh thanks for watching stay tuned for more reviews i have some other flashlight coming in stay tuned it's fish ration time oh. those little fishes see the little fishes wow are they spawning out here <laughs>